When you're using a router to round over the edge of a piece, sometimes it can be a challenge to get the depth set just right so that the, the radius rolls up to a nice, perfect tangent to the edge. How I do it, I start with setting the router depth a little too deep, so I make a cut just a little deep, and I leave a little lip on it. And then from there, I go too shallow and start edging my way up. To make it obvious for the demonstration, I've painted one side of this piece of maple black. Let's see how it works. Now you can see right here, maybe on the screen, that I have a lip here. It's where I cut way too deep into it. They're about a 30 second or so too deep. Now I'm going to lower the router bit, and as I make the cut, the clean section of the wood will be much shallower. And as I raise the bit, the white area will move back towards this nice crisp line. And when that line meets right there, I've got the best tension I want to get with that router bit. Here we go. And there I have it. I've worked it up slowly so that the overcut line is now perfectly in line with what I've just cut. You might see a little feathering of the black paint as I've just barely eased up into that point of tangency. That's going to give me as nice a round over as I'm going to get. Uh, now I throw away the scrap piece and I go to the real wood and work from there. Thank you.